Um, so this is our 50th anniversary of Days of Our Lives, and as you can see, we are doing a commemorative photo shoot, and we're all excited and uh, just all so um, grateful and proud to be a part of Days of Our Lives. It has been so fun to just see so many cast members that have been a part of Days of Our Lives for all these years coming back to just recreate these beautiful love stories and uh, just uh, family legacies and to keep carrying those on and, and just to repeat um, just how I feel Days of Our Lives started with, you know, like Ken has been saying, with these beautiful families and how they get through life and really we're all just broken people and how we function and love each other well and get through relationships and adventures and um, so it's been fun to go back and see a lot of flashbacks and uh, relive our history. Well, I started when I was 18 in uh, 1985, so this is now 2015. Uh, it's been 30 years, and I left for a couple years in between to have my babies. And then uh, Ken has always been so wonderful. He always leaves the door open, and that's been a great gift. So I've come back, and now, so this is the 30th year that I've been a part of Days of Our Lives. and. You know, our characters change. We, I know the writers try to stay as true as possible to the original, but you know, with times changing and different seasons, I think they try to, you know, have us expand and grow in different ways um, as we do as people. So really just a natural life cycle. And then sometimes we go, oh, bad choice. Let's go back to what we know. And, um, but it's fun to kind of go on that ride with them and try new things and experience new things and go, okay, that worked, that didn't work. Let's go back to what we know works for sure. I think sometimes we don't really realize how incredible it is. Cause I, I, you know, it's such, we come in every day, makeup and hair, we're running lines all day and we're just trying to get this show done and, and um, push out a show, you know, for every day for people to watch that we don't realize sometimes. And it's only as I've gotten older that I go, wow, I cannot believe I have been on this show called Days of Our Lives that's been on TV for 50 years. And you know, it just kind of hits you because it, it just becomes your everyday work. But there are those moments where I go, I'm so grateful and thankful to work in Hollywood for this many years straight. I mean, it just doesn't happen. Of course, working with Mac and Francis, that's so special to my heart. They were the first two people I worked with when I came on. So it was like having a real grandma and grandpa to teach me about Hollywood. I was right out of New Jersey. I knew nothing and they showed me everything and what to look out for and, and just taught me sort of a street smart about Hollywood and being in this business. And I'm so honored that they sort of raised me and said, you know, don't make bad choices. Don't, don't be a young person in Hollywood. And um, they were holding me accountable and that was really a great thing. And then of course, working with Billy Warlock and then incredible Matt Ashford came in which just threw everything upside down for me and we just had the most incredible storyline we had our kids at the same time he would like go go home to a pregnant wife come to work to a pregnant wife <laughs> so poor Matt it was like <laughs> he'd come in going how do you feel today <laughs> but it was Matt and I just had a great great love story and the writers just Matt brought something so different to daytime and the writers loved it. And I got to be a part of that, which was, I'm grateful because he sort of made me stretch beyond things I was comfortable doing. And he just brought this great humor. I think the fans are the backbone of this show. They know our stories. They know the storylines. They know the history. They know everything about this show. And the minute it goes off course, they are the first ones to go, no way, they would never do that because of this, 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 and this. And even things that we don't remember. And I believe they do listen and um, you know, keep up with all the social media with what everyone's saying. And they, you know, we're so far ahead shooting wise. So if something comes on and they don't love it, there's still a couple months that we have to work through to maybe get to the end of it. But yeah, our fans are faithful. They have never left us. <laughs> To Days of Our Lives, happy 
50th anniversary. We are so grateful to all be here with you to celebrate Can, and we love you, and here's to 50 more. <laughs>